What up, YouTube? Been out here in the garage getting a little work done today. Got that little fire back, so been in the garage a lot lately. Got out here and raised the uh, body up a little bit more earlier. And can you ready to get these suspension parts together up here? The uh, stirring parts, rather. Get the stirring parts on there. Slide it on in there. And uh, once I get it in, I put the front wheels on to support the weight because I know these casters not going to do it. I don't think they rated for that much weight. So that's why I really want to get the rear end in so I can go ahead and get the body down. Got some more bricks up front. Some more out back. So yeah, it's about ready. It's about ready to come on down. Get it together. Finish moving out the firewall. Um, getting ready to make my uh, heater box delete plate. So I can uh, get ready to start uh, mocking up my under, uh, under dash heat AC unit. These are all the wires from my uh, LS harness. Just sitting in the car. Running behind the motor up in there. You know, I want everything to be clean as possible. Uh, don't really want no wires to be shown. Only the ones that has to be shown. So I got them running down the back of the engine. They're going to be under the... Uh, under the, the coil covers, most of the wires, so you won't see those. Want well, my engine bay super clean, so that's what I'm doing, smoothing out the firewall. Got a little bit more of this, uh, I don't know if y'all can see it, this gunky stuff on here, man. Hit that with a little heat to warm, to, to soften it up, and the wire wheel, knock it clean off. Smooth that joint out. Uh, yeah. About that time, man, I've been slacking. You know, every once in a while you get tired of these cars, so you, uh, you know, you gotta take a little break on them. Yeah, you know, you got everything ready to go. Pull the dash back out, set it to the side for a minute. We'll be going back in shortly. This wood from out of here. Got the wood out. So now, it's just bring that baby on down. Go back and check uh, mount number three because it has a little little thing from under the body that uh has to go into the the rubber mount. That's the little nipple that uh sticks down on mount number three. I just gotta make sure it lines up and goes through the hole on the top of the mount. So yeah, that was just what I was concerned about. Slide that up in there. Over the hole. Mm, damn. Everything looking good, everything looking good. Let me stop it right there. 